DNS, or Domain Name System, is how your web browser knows that a certain website points to a certain server. If you've registered a domain name outside of Media Temple, there's a couple of different steps that you have to take in order to get your domain pointing to Media Temple's servers. Now let's take a look at how we do that. Now we're going to take a look at how to point our DNS to Media Temple's servers. This is something that you'll only need to do if you've registered a domain outside of Media Temple. First, log in to your account control panel on Media Temple. Now, click on one of your domains. Then, scroll down and click on Domain Tools and edit DNS zone file. If you haven't pointed your DNS to Media Temple servers, you'll get a warning saying that this won't affect your live DNS and that you have to point your domain names to ns1 and ns2.mediatemple.net. It also points you to a knowledge base article on the subject. I host my domains at a company called Namecheap, and here is one of my domains. This domain doesn't actually go anywhere, but it's still pretty cool. Now I've logged into my domain name control panel and I've clicked domain name server setup. Instead of using my registrar's hosting DNS services, I'm going to specify my own custom DNS servers. And then just go over here and you can copy ns1.mediatemple.net and ns2.mediatemple.net. Then click on save changes. And if you scroll down, it should say that ns1.mediatemple.net and ns2.mediatemple.net are your DNS servers. After you've done that, it will take a little while for this message to update saying that your DNS is live. Once you do that, you've successfully pointed your DNS to Media Temple servers. Great job! And that's how you set up DNS on Media Temple servers.